Hello, I'm David Hughes. Welcome to Your Perfect Body, the podcast of the Esoteric Teaching Community. Today's selection is an essay entitled The Brotherhood of the Esoteric Teaching. Those who are sincerely interested in pursuing higher knowledge and spiritual realization through the esoteric teaching are invited to apply for initiation into the brotherhood of the esoteric teaching. The esoteric teaching is the ancient lineage of spiritual absolute truth that descends from the spiritual world to benefit the souls of this material world with spiritual knowledge and devotional service leading to liberation from material existence. It is also an international brotherhood and community of world teachers, master teachers, teachers, initiates, candidates, and associates. The members of the order consider themselves most blessed and fortunate to be the stewards of the ancient esoteric teaching, the original source of all the world's spiritual paths, and an unlimited reservoir of spiritual knowledge. Our work is very confidential and very important to the welfare of the entire planet. Some of the members of our order are well known in public life, although their membership in the order is kept confidential. Due to recent critical developments in the world situation, there is an open requirement for qualified spiritual master teachers. Therefore, the opportunity is now available to associates, such as yourself, to become a candidate to receive initiation, provided, of course, that you develop or possess the proper qualifications. If you are accepted as a candidate and successfully complete your training, you will receive initiation into the order of the esoteric teaching. As an initiate of the order, you will receive many privileges and benefits. For example, world-class, graduate-level training and mentoring in spirituality, meditation, yoga, and all other aspects of self-realization and spiritual life. A secure lifetime career in your chosen specialty within the broad field of the esoteric teaching travel opportunities to almost any part of the world, access to an international network of thousands of temples, ashrams, schools, and the limitless resources of the order, access to the confidential scriptures and ancient historical records of the esoteric teaching, cessation of all material miseries through practice of the original complete methods of yoga and Tantra, the precious opportunity to benefit others with the same potent knowledge that you receive in your training in the esoteric teaching, the peace of mind and heart that comes from complete security, freedom, and right livelihood, and too much more to include here, not only because of lack of space, but also for reasons of confidentiality. Becoming an initiate is not for everyone. It requires dedication, discipline, and a lifetime commitment to the Brotherhood of the Esoteric Teaching. To qualify for initiation into the Brotherhood of the Esoteric Teaching, you must meet certain spiritual requirements. It is the responsibility of candidates for initiation to know, understand, and apply these requirements in their lives. All the requirements are contained in the Key of Wisdom, the mystic key to the Gate of Initiation. These are from the Bhagavad Gita. The Blessed Lord said, Truthfulness, fearlessness, purification of one's existence, cultivation of spiritual knowledge, charity, self-control, performance of sacrifice, 
study of the scriptures, austerity and simplicity, nonviolence, freedom from anger, renunciation, tranquility, aversion to fault-finding, compassion and freedom from covetousness, gentleness, modesty, and steady determination, vigor, forgiveness, fortitude, cleanliness, freedom from envy and the passion for honor. These transcendental qualities belong to godly persons endowed with the divine nature. Humility, pridelessness, nonviolence, tolerance, simplicity, approaching a bona fide spiritual master teacher, cleanliness, steadiness, and self-control, renunciation of the objects of sense gratification, absence of false ego, the perception of the evil of birth, death, old age, and disease, non-attachment to spouse, children, home, and the rest, and even-mindedness amid pleasant and unpleasant events, constant and unalloyed devotion to me, Krishna, resorting to solitary places, detachment from the general mass of people, accepting the importance of self-realization and philosophical search for the absolute truth. All these I thus declare to be knowledge, and what is contrary to these is ignorance. So these are Krishna's words, and these are our requirements for initiation as well. A long time ago, I decided what I wanted to do with my life. I wanted to know the highest truth, and I wanted to have a direct personal relationship with God. I had strong faith. I worked very hard, overcame all the obstacles, and climbed to the top of the mountain. I was very fortunate and had a lot of good help and guidance. I am very thankful for everything I have been privileged to attain and realize in this short life. And now I have just one more thing to do before I can rest content. You have been wandering alone, sleepwalking in the matrix of material existence now for many millennia. Sometimes you have dreamed of enjoyment and sometimes of suffering. Sometimes in your dream you have been rich and sometimes broke, sometimes free and sometimes enslaved. Everything you have seen, everything you have bought and sold in this marketplace of material life is transitory, illusory, an imitation made of straw. This dream has not satisfied your soul. That's why you're here today, searching for the absolute truth. I have literally returned from the mountain where I received the esoteric teaching to meet you in your dream in the matrix and offer to share with you everything that I have learned and attained. I offer you something real, substantial, and satisfying. This I promise you. This path leads out of the dream, out of the matrix, to the highest and best that there is in life. And what you attain will be the eternal, imperishable, absolute truth. Now it is time for you to decide. The esoteric teaching is not an easy path, and it is not for everyone. Is it for you? Do you want to remain in your dream or to awaken? Take the blue pill and you go back to sleep, and everything remains the same. Take the red pill and you awaken and see the truth. But then, you can never again go back to your sleep and dreams. Think now while you have all the facts fresh in your mind and fix your determination. This door will not remain open for long. For most people, the opportunity to join a real esoteric school may come once in a lifetime, if it comes at all. If you miss this chance, there may never be another. Come with me, then, 
within the within, beyond the beyond. Come with me to a place where there is truth, fearlessness, certainty, and clarity, and an eternal festival of happiness for the mind and senses, where there's full understanding and full compassion, where there's no blame, there's no shame, 